One final question, sir, and I want to talk about politics, really. Uh, the most anticipated event is the elections, and pretty much everyone, as you mentioned, the economy is waiting for a change in government to figure out uh, how the road ahead pans out. Earlier this year, you had there was a feeling that you're going to see the BJP-led NDA uh, perhaps on the resurgence. But ever since the rise of the Aam Aadmi Party in Delhi, uh, things have changed a bit. How do you see the equation changing? What's, what's the sense that you're getting? I would uh, be somewhat hesitant to uh, talk about uh, political issues uh, on camera. Uh, uh, and I don't want to talk about which party I would support or not support. But uh, what I certainly want to remark is that AAP has certainly redefined the political landscape uh, in the country, uh, not just in terms of how the balance might, might uh, change, but also uh, raised expectations of, uh, uh, of uh, common man in terms of what they expect from their politician or political leaders, uh, holding them accountable, uh, looking for change in the way uh, the political leadership behaves. So I think that is a very good change. It doesn't matter who comes to power, whether it is AAP, whether it is BJP, whether it is Congress, some coalition, third front, doesn't matter. Who comes to power? Whoever comes to power will have to rethink the way political leadership behaves, the way political uh, leadership is held accountable, right. the way they act, all of that will change. So that is certainly something that AAP has done, and I hope that continues. I hope that that impact that AAP has had on the, on the country continues, irrespective of, again, I'm repeating, uh, I'm, not, I'm not trying to say who may be better government uh, at the central uh, uh, come May 2014.